Yoshi back in Smash 4. And Pocket Luigi as well. Mm -hmm. But don't know if he's playing any of those characters here. Sura is definitely one of those Marios who loves to use Flood. Uh, that's one of his main tools. Uh, flood and Gape. He loves Flood and Gape. Yeah, Flood is, flood is such a good move because like it'll just, it'll just push you back and give you stage control. Yeah, and it's also a really good gipping tool as well. If you notice your opponent's going a little bit too far out, you just push them out a little bit further with that with that flood there. Mm -hmm. Sura's one of those players that is actually kind of kind of decent at recognizing those situations. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure if he's changed up his game plan in uh, in ultimate. Mm -hmm. An interesting note about flood is uh the fact that you can shield it, but it can shield poke. Yeah, I think that's I think that's cool. You get shield poke by water, just get blown back a little bit, just. Imagine a wind box having a shield poke. Right. Well, it couldn't be me. <laughs> Play no characters with a wind box. Bro, imagine if if Palutena could uh, wind box could uh, could shield poke. That'd be wild. I think it does. Does it? I don't know. I I've like seen people F smash, and then like it still pushed them back. So who knows? But either way, Greninja. so KZ, ooh, Greninja. Greninja is definitely a character that like a lot of people have been talking about. Those who like have Greninjas in the region, like good Greninjas, are like this character's top tier, and then everyone else is like, nah, that character can't do anything. Yeah, it's because they, uh, a lot of people have either a lot of exposure or no exposure, as you said. And Shoto, definitely one of the best Greninjas in the world as well, mm -hmm. showing us exactly what the what the Frog Ninja can do. And Greninja has so many things you can do in this game. His Water Shuriken so good. Dash attack, and here we go. Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, the dash attack and um. His down normals are amazing. Yeah, dash attack, down tilt, so many. He can do so much damage. Yeah, oh, and landing there. We can't forget about landing there. One of Nair, his Yeah, Nair got better now, because if you like run off, if you're off stage and you Nair, you won't die immediately. You still will sometimes, but. Depending on uh, how you how you decide to fall with the Nair there. Mm -hmm. And RKZ having a bit of trouble getting in. He's gotten these stray hits, but not too much. Let's yes. go for the sliding up tilt, but not going to hit. Going to go out with the full rapid jab there. Sura with the flood on deck. And RKZ's kind of retreating back, trying to like bait uh, Sura going in, but Sura knows he doesn't have to. He's just giving up a lot of space at this point. All right, Sura continuing these up air chains. Not going to be able to continue it past 50. Ooh, Sura swinging this move. It's looking kind of crisp. An interesting thing about Sir as well is he's one of those Maros who, even though when he's feeling himself, he won't normally go for a fair. He just go for the safe option. Oh, goes for the up B. Just barely off the mark too. Yeah, tries to call him out. That's so hype when Mario just jumps up there and just hits you. All right, does get the flood on the shadow sneak there, and no, not gonna go with a back air there. Down Another air. down air. Not gonna kill yet, but 140%. Oh, gotta take that second stock. Sir now up three stocks to one. KZ is not really. Not really finding his uh his strides here. Yeah, Casey trying to get uh, trying to get these up airs here, not able to apply himself, throwing out that forward smash twice. Yeah, I think Casey's kind of like going for uh, these kill moves. He really wants to get a hit. He's getting a little too anxious. I'd like to see him like slow down a little bit. Yeah, especially even though Greninja's a fast character, he can play the slow game. He needs to start using Water Shuriken a little bit more, even though uh, Mario has the game. Oh, Sir is continuing this. Wow, he just ate so much percent. Sir is. Sir is doing so much damage to him. Back here in the blast zone. Yeah, we're going to get that one. Three stock from that, Sura. That was really good conversion, too. He got him with the down tilt, then instant turnaround back here. Then uh, falling back off stage with the double jump back here. Very nice awareness from Sura. Yeah, Sura going to take that one with a three stock. KZ was doing all right. He was, like, getting these hits in, but it didn't seem like he really had what he wanted to do in neutral down. He was just kind of going with the flow and just kind of like, oh, I should do this right now. Yeah, it, yeah, a lot of the hits that he, he was placing onto Sir weren't game changing. They weren't momentum shifting as well. Yeah. Uh, they're, they're, as you said, stray hits. Um, things that he could he could have fall uh, followed up on, but wasn't confident about. So he, he allowed his advantage to uh, scale back into neutral. Yeah, I like to like uh, I'd like to see him go for a little bit more uh, water shurikens, like you said. Maybe not so many shadow sneaks. And for game two, we're gonna go to FD. This, uh, this is the stage Greninja likes. You have so much space to do all your combos because uh, Greninja's combos are like kind of carry you across the uh, the stage kind of combos. Yeah. All right, Ooh, sir. Fair. Expecting an air dodge down, not gonna be able to get it off of KZ. KZ gets a full rapid jab there. Could have held that a bit longer, but still damage is damage. He's actually this is a lot more even than the first game was going. Shadow sticks a little bit uh, 
a little bit trickier to see on FD, especially with, uh, with the dark floor as well. Yeah, you really have to be looking out for it. Gets the counter, but actually just missing because of the Mario pancaking. Yeah, not going to be able to get the substitute there. Going to go with a forward throw and backer? No, not yet. Air dodge in, going to get thrown out back off stage immediately. Sir, so setting up for another back air here. Forward throw immediately. Ooh. Oh, just barely messing up his angle. I think he thought he was going to go up a little more. Yeah. All right, trying to get another down air here, and gets the up throw down air, up air? No, oh, just barely missed the up air. But Sir is still is going in right now with these hits. All right, Casey getting a little bit, that big shadow sneak. He crossed him up with the back air, but not catching the hit. Yeah, down air, you can't really punish that. Even if you parry it, oh my god, he was so close. He even jumped into it too, not able to get the, the strong hit of fair there. A little bit too early on the hitbox. Oh, Ooh, actually just jumping right into the up smash. Wow. Casey kind of threw that out, but you know what? It worked. Well, works, works, dude. Uh, Definitely. I was also surprised that it was just straight up sweet spot of up smash as well. All right, gonna go with the back throw here. Nice fireballs. Oh my gosh, yeah, back air just not gonna fully connect. Right now, 130% on KZ. He needs to get these hit. He needs to retreat back to center stage. I find it interesting that Sura is actually just not opting to use any of his smash attacks. I don't think he's throwing out one. Sura's just sitting there. <laughs> like, Honestly, finally KZ getting some chance to go back to the stage. F tilts him to get him off the platform, and now he's finally returned to center stage, actually getting him off stage. Wait, what? What? Oh, there's, there's the up smash good. Uh, I think he caught the DI. I think he was looking to run away and immediately just... Yeah. Substitute has a little bit too much lag for him to to get out of it in time. I'm actually calling the air dodge in, but Sir reacting a little too late to that. Right now, Sir is looking really good right now. KZ is just not able to find his stride, and his advantage state just isn't enough to bring this one. Uh, not to bring it back, but like it's just not enough to really. Ooh, never mind. You know what? I'll Sir, stop <laughs> Sir definitely got caught on the bad DI there. Definitely don't think he should have died there. But nevertheless, back here at one stock piece. He gets another F smash. All right, let's see if KZ can actually get something started. You know, he might be he might be struggling, but he still does have a set of one stock uh, game and an air dodging down. That's not how you want to see it go. He ac he actually air dodged to the side, but he was just a little bit below the ledge for him to catch it. Yeah, I'm not sure if he could have made that one back. I think if he did like completely diagonal and then straight up, maybe. But I'm that might have been too low. Anyways. I don't even think he had a jump. I think he needs a jump to make it back there. Probably. Because FD has like a ceiling below it now, right? I think. 